Dark Glare Warlock. The goal is to stick a Dark Glare, play some self-damage minions like Flame Imp, Cobalt Librarian, and even Raise Dead in order to regain some of those mana crystals to get an early Flesh Giant down and then start pushing face. It's got a small discard package in Malchazar's Imp, Soulfire, Nightshade Matron, and Doom Guard, but these are all tend towards aggressive minions that kind of want to fit into this deck anyway, with the exception of Expired Merchant, which gives you a little bit more consistency into the Hand of Gul'dan. Uh, Tour Guide is a real standout in this deck because it makes your hero power cost zero, but then you refresh the mana crystals with a Dark Glare on board. So you can play this on turn two, stick a Dark Glare. If you're watching on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash raffle. Watch this! I think I need to, um play less of the Malkazar Simp and like more things that get me closer to the uh, the Dark Glare. Molly Mock, thank you for the 100 bits. If being made of flesh is worth noting, what are, what are the other giants made of? Uh, usually they are elementals, right? Or frequently they are elementals. Okay. Dark Glare would be nice, but I've also just got uh, Karen into Malkazar Simp. That's pretty good next turn. There is so much Wait, where? that's not where I wanted that to go. Oh well. But turn three, Nightshade into Fistum. We do have a Defile, potentially, but they need to coin it out. You are not the boss of me. Oh, sure. I need something for this to attack into anyway. I'd rather this hit a minion right now, so I'm just going to play it out and then reassess. Nice. Get fisted. I'm going to hold this in case I draw into Dark Glare. So what's died so far? Just a Malkazar Zimp? Okay. Eh. That's not very good for them, is it? I'll probably play this on one. I think it's fine. Follow it up with a... Uh... Let's turn one tap. Seems okay. I like it a little bit less next. Now. Uh, we want to make a really strong turn four play, I think. <laughs> four play. So I'm going to tap again. Look for a one drop that actually pairs with the Dark Glare. Your tour ends here. Big yikes. Perfect. A little agony goes a long way. Good turn. Hysteria shouldn't full clear this, right? Hmm. A little agony goes a long way. This deck list came from famous wild Hearthstone streamer, Get Me Off. Your 
That's too many cards. Uh, there's no coin scream. That doesn't do anything. You can just fist him for lethal. Okay. In the mirror, which is what we assume it is, I think I just want to find the dark glare, but I do want to turn one still. Would Spellstone be good in this? Um, probably not, no. You win the aggro mirror by making a better board faster than the opponent. Healing is irrelevant, especially when you spend four mana on it. You are not the boss of me. God, we can not find a Dark Glare, can we? I think I have to play one of these just to challenge that. It might get soul fired, but not much I can do about that. I don't want to play that this turn. It's good next turn. Next turn, we do get to draw a whole lot with the... Uh... That's fine. Well, we could actually coin out the Nightshade Maiden. That might be better depending on what they throw out here. So that'll still free up mana for the uh, eventual Dark Glare turn. There we go. It's a lot of soul fires, so. though. Yeesh. Have some card draw, I guess. Double Dark Glare. Okay, well, if this gets soul fired, at least we have some uh, recycle next turn. Yeah. This is fine. Oh. Okay. So I could soul fire that and look for tour guide or it's just tour guide, so it's an 8-8. We just make an 8-8. Next turn we can go tap, soul fire. We don't have many activators for the Dark Glare left because we played the uh, the librarians early. Flush Giants look scary. Imagine how uh <laughs> imagine how scary they look for the opponent right now. All their burst is gone. Just win next turn. That was a really frustrating turn. There 
is so much untapped power in this world. The truth is in here. I don't think Vulgar is worth a keep. I'd rather draw into it off of the Dark Glare pop-off turns. I want to play this on turn two, so I need to find another one drop, I think. Well, that works too. So I play this, I'm not tapping next turn or this turn for sure. I'm gonna tap on three, but next turn I can just play the expired merchant. Evident, thank you for gifting that sub to Sam. Really appreciate that generosity. And welcome uh, Sam Laredo to the Raffle Rabble. Hey, I got you, friend. Hey Pidgey. Let's fist them, chat. No, don't. It's still good. Mm, wrong target, but that's okay. Munch, thank you for the prime. Welcome to the Raffle Rabble. Okay, we've got our powerful turn coming up. Or potentially powerful. That looks strong to me. A little agony goes a long way. Mm -hmm. A little agony goes a long way. No, don't. It's still good. Run away. Here for the door. Well done. We did it, chat. One dark glare down. Ugh. That's okay. Uh, we've got a free tap. <laughs> Do you think we have enough fists in hand, chat? I should probably just play one and then tap, right? Is there any reason to kill that? These are all going face, right? I think we just go face. Bleh. Yeah, it was a... Uh, okay. There is so much untapped power in this world. I think given the amount of mana I have left, I don't really need to be concerned about getting more Dark Glare value. Probably do want to make some board space though. We just top deck dumb guard and uh, discard all of these. Now I am complete. Tour guide lethal. What a good boy. I don't think I like any of these cards. The Karen's kind of cute. Tempted to keep that. All right. Guess we're doing it again. Someone's gotta lead the charge. Or we're just gonna die. I need to make a play for board here. I can use the uh, the raised dead to get these back on uh, on turn three. Well, there is so much untapped power in this world. Maybe I should have gone for the high roll on the Karen, but Such a fate. Oh no. What have you done? A little agony goes a long way. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. 
Uh, I need to tap. Well, I don't need that. This gets me to three. I can play this and this. There is so much untapped power in this world. Next turn I play the Nightshade, and that should uh, allow me to stabilize. Inconsequential. I tap first, because it's free. Oh, we're going to burn that now. That's a whoopsie. How did I miss that? What do you think about Valorant? Uh, I haven't played it, so... I don't think a whole lot about it, to be honest. I don't think I want to... draw any more cards here, do I? We've got lethal showing, so there's no reason to um, to draw. When we could potentially chain draw the bombs. Only need to draw one bomb now. Oof, that is not a bomb. Well. Oh no, I don't want to do that. <laughs> oh my god, I almost BM'd myself into death. Uh, tour guide usually usually seems like a good keep. I would keep this with a uh, hand of Gul'dan, but tour guide's just good for setting up dark glare turns or drawing into dark glare. With the raise dead now, I think I just uh, play the tour guide and tap because this is gonna die early, and then I can get him back for the uh, dark glare turn anyway. Is it better than? I don't think it's better than this, is it? This is good. Uh, the reason this is good is if this dies, I could coin a Dark Glare, play this, get a free tap, then play this, and I just get to... Like, I guess it's the same thing as if, um... I don't know. They seem very similar. If they don't tap here, they have a Dark Glare in hand. They do not have it. Dark Glare off the top. Unlucky. Do I ever just pitch away a Flesh Giant to get more of them? I think that seems okay. The only thing this doesn't do is, uh, like, get me closer to a Dark Glare draw, but gets me closer to some Thick Giants. It doesn't seem like the opponent's doing a whole lot here. Oh my god. Yeah. A little agony goes a long way. Set up for next turn. I could lose a giant here, but yeah, that's fine. I trade and I get him back next turn. So I go Dark Glare and feels good. Zero Dark Glares on their side. We should just get at least three giants here. Might even be worth like throwing out the expired merchant. Nah. Yeah, I'll throw out the expired merchant, see if I can. No, because then I don't get to keep this one anyway, so. Okay. Hardly seems relevant. As a very defensive play. A little agony goes a long way. Yo, 
Your turn. So that's an example of why I don't think Spellstone is good in this deck. It just, it accomplished nothing for them when our life total is much lower than theirs, but we're able to leverage that into um, into a winning board state without having to allocate four mana to effectively nothing. I'll keep the uh, Librarian look for Dark Glare. Do I want to try and draw it into Tour Guide or just shove out a Flame Imp or pass? Is that crazy? I think passing is crazy. I just tap next turn. I play this coin uh, Kobold into Hero Power. deck obviously works wonderfully due to Dark Glare, but how do you play the deck when you don't find it? Uh, you play it like a, I mean, pretty typical zoo deck. Um, but like, with your hero power being life tap and like also just the librarian and other card draw, you even expired merchant into Hand of Gul'dan, like you don't really have a hard time drawing it most of the time. I don't really want to pitch the uh, the Doom Guard here, but I might. Now I will. Sure. Let's tap first. See if we can hit this and. No, nope, let's play that instead of the Matron. Not quite dead. Seems like most classes have a get a get the card to win the game option now. I mean, that's just kind of an inevitable result of a um, eternal format, isn't it? But you know, there's a dumb guard in there. <laughs> I don't think that helps you. Uh, I still don't think that helps you. Still dead on board. I see you later, Blob. Thanks for hanging out. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Nope. Always two or guide lethal. Well, we got a Dark Glare. I wonder if I keep a Flesh Giant with a Dark Glare already. Let's try it. Abunculus. Seems okay. I need a one mana guy to activate, or like tour guide would be phenomenal. I could try to, no, that's crazy. I'll do it next turn. I'll Solarium into a uh, tour guide next turn or attempt to rather. Or I could just tap like a normal like a normal human. Point that out. At least it challenges this now, and then I just go Dark Glare, tap, Vulgar, Vulgar. I could even uh, Solarium behind that. Molly Mock, thank you for the 100 bits. Ah, uh, yes, we can all life tap, right, fellow humans? It's true. A little agony goes a long way. Let's go here first.
Okay, uh, we get our giants next turn and potentially a dumb guard alongside it. Oh my god. I must have slain one hundred or so. Prove your worth. Molly Mock, thank you for the hundred bits. Is it? It's too bad. That Fist of Draxus can't hit face for more dark player value. Hit our own face, yeah. If only. Wait. Oh, that came off of the first day of school. Sure. It's uh, not gaining me any mana, but I think I need to play that. I don't think I need to draw the extra cards off of the uh, off of the dumb guard here. So, this is just fine. Good turn. Looks like I'm here just in time. The victory is yours. I don't think I'd keep a flesh giant without a uh, a dark glare. None will survive. Huh. This might be a tough one, chat. I can play that next turn. I just want something that challenges the board a little bit. That doesn't bother me. That bothers me. We can still win if we hit a dark glare. Let's help them out a little bit. Let's see who can do the most damage to Raffle this game. Well, we missed the Dark Glare. I still draw three, so I could hit a Dark Glare this turn. Nice. Um, that might be enough to help us win. Wait, why did I coin there? That was weird. Forgot to put the quest in? What quest? Oh, you're making a joke about the discard quest. Good one. Okay, please hit the fist. <laughs> One damage off legal chat. Uh, we're dead to skill command. Yep. Well, we outraced Odd to Hunter, so clearly this is the best deck. I'm tempted to keep Karen, but um, probably not without the Dark Glare support. Probably just play Librarian on one. We can get it back with the raised dead once it dies. Tour guide is good on two, going into the dark glare turn.
Hearing thud seems a bit useless. Um, that has not been my experience at all. These are all really good off of raised dead, so I might as well get value off of them now. Dark glare? Nope. Well, maybe I'll get him off of this. I suppose that's also a good outcome. I think I can tap. Because I have uh, raised dead in to bring those back anyway. So let's tap. That's fine. We just uh, commit the mana to raise dead and then... Or the uh, mana to dark glare and then we raise dead and we should be able to play our hand. And the combination of tour guide and... Um, uh, Cobalt is really good. Inferior genetics. Thank you for the $5 tip. Love your YouTube videos. Thank you so much. That's nice of you to say. All right. Let's do this. Do I have mana or hand space? Definitely got mana. Oh, we get the dumb guard back. That's not really what I wanted. I don't think I will, actually. Yeah. We missed the fist, chat. But they shouldn't have a good mass hysteria here. It is finished. You win. Thank you to legendary patrons Anonymous Toast, IGN Unknown, Justice Crater, Fizzle Jizzix, Molly Mock, Boardman5, Matthew Crow, and Nick the Chef. 